crazy you say that. When Katie, when she first walked up, she looked right at Prime and said, I followed you when I was a kid. Yeah, she you made me feel guy. like I was 70 years old. Oh, oh I'm yeah, so sorry. That's what you did. You hurt my feelings, Katie. Well, I, that, I think that was just what you heard and not my intention. <laughs> so we should have a little therapy over that. Yeah, we should. Um, I just wanted to say that I'm a fan of yours because Thank the you. only football I ever watched was after church. And I watched when the church after church when I watched the Cowboys um, and we would get together with another uh, church family and watch the Cowboys. And that's the only team I ever watched growing they, up. Those were the good days when they Those were winning. Those were the great days. Like and we were now. rooting for them the whole time. We were very somber and sad uh, when it didn't happen a couple of weeks ago. If you played football, what position would you play? Because I heard you in your press conference say, you know, they call me the boss. And um, well, you know. You'd have to say quarterback, right? I'd be a right? cheerleader. Yeah, quite honestly, no, I like no, that. no Good especially answer. with the outfit you yes, have on right now. Exactly. I've I had this outfit made for today. Um, I generally love a theme so much. Mm -hmm. So uh, when the theme became football, I was like, everything football. I am dressed for the ball. But you came. <laughs> you, you look like you're ready to play. And it's all the way down to your toenails. I saw That's on social right. media. I've got football fingers, football toes. I mean, I, I can't get enough of that stuff. Katie, you remind me of the, like, the Seattle Seahawks. You know, one team, the Patriots, they're serious. The Seahawks are having fun. Are they? You're having fun this Oh, my week. gosh, I'm having so much fun. And I love the Seahawks. Um, I'm friends with Russell Wilson, and um, uh, we've been texting just this week, and I was just asking him about his approach during the game, and he was telling me that I was, I was saying, what do you eat? Like, hot, what fuel do you put in your body to run so fast? because I want that same feel, whether it's like a protein shake or like a paleo diet. diet. And he's like, cheeseburger and pizzas. And I was like, great, yeah. that's great. You're like, nah, <laughs> I'm not gonna fit in that dress if I have that, right? No, no I, I, I do have like, um, uh, well, Girl Scout cookie season happened to start right now mm -hmm. during um, football Super Bowl, uh, which I think is a total sabotage on their behalf towards me. And, but I have ordered <laughs> 100 Thin Mint Girl Scout cookies from the city of Phoenix to be delivered to my house, to be put on ice right after I am on the field. And you have roots here. <laughs> Tell me about your roots from Phoenix. Yes, um, my parents are traveling ministers, or they were, especially when I was growing up. And so we hopped around and they started churches in lots of different places around the USA. And so um, we stayed here in Phoenix doing that kind of work for a couple of years, and I went to Paradise Valley Christian no, we, School. We have some, we have some footage of, of oh, your you elementary do? school. Oh, goodness. Um, well, we can't see it right now, but anyway. No, but we, yeah, my kindergarten and first grade, uh, some of my here most impressionable years were here at Par and, Paradise Valley Christian School. Oh, and we got a picture oh, of God, you from 1990. Oh, yeah, that's me. Oh, yeah. Look, I lost the tooth. <laughs> that's pretty cute. <laughs> that girl's like, will I ever play the <laughs> halftime show? <laughs> okay, um, so speaking of that, will I ever play the halftime show? A hundred million viewers. Are you nervous at all? Can I say yes, I am human? <laughs> um, of course I am a little nervous, but I am well prepared. I've probably already done the show over 30 to 35 times myself. So I know every play um, for me. And um, I'm well rested and I've been on tour. I've already done 108 t shows on my own tour. Mm -hmm. Um, so it's not like I'm coming from like being a recluse or like coming back into the spotlight. I'm already I'm in a routine and I have been for a year. So, I mean, all that being said, like anything can happen. But um, I feel very prepared, very excited. I'm going to have so much fun. Like yesterday when I was rehearsing on the field, I was like, you know what? This is going to be different about my performance, I think, than a lot of other people is that you're going to see how much fun I'm having. You, 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 you sound like a fun girl. I am a very fun girl. Yes. Now, now tell me this. Like, All American fun. With, with football players, if we hadn't been to the Super Bowl to play, we'll call other players and say, you know, Excuse can me? you give me some advice? What's that? Football players hadn't been to the Super Bowl, we'll call other players to get advice. Oh, Would yeah. Would you ever reach out to a Beyonce or a Madonna and say, you know, can you tell me what to expect? Um, I, I actually uh, reached out to Bruno Mars at one point, and I asked him, how many days before Sunday do I get the spray tan? <laughs> and um, he, he, he didn't he appreciate didn't have that. The answer yeah, exactly. Okay, right. um, but he's been he's been somewhat kind, you know. And and we have a really great relationship with the NFL, and they've been so kind to us. And you know, we've just figured out along the way, uh, just kind of marked our steps along the way. I wanted to ask you about your favorite halftime Super Bowl performance, but I know you and I were talking about what you did 
how you watch Beyonce? Oh, yes. Um, I've been watching and also doing my research and homework on the halftime show. Um, I even saw the Michael Jackson show where back in the day it was daytime and yeah. mm -hmm. um, he stood there just straight solid for a minute and 30 seconds and moved his chin once. And you could see the people behind him going through the whole chart of emotions like, this is great. What is happening? This is awful. This is crazy. <laughs> like, for a minute and a half, because, you know, these performances are only 12 and a half minutes. So, like, every minute counts. And thankfully, I have a lot of songs, so I am really cramming a lot of information into my show. But um, as of lately, I really appreciated the uh, graphic design and the visual aspect of Madonna. And then I also really appreciate, of course, I'm such a Beyonce stan. Like, I love her. Uh, she does the best hair flip in the world. I'm, I'm going to try and do a couple hair flips. But You're going to have the fans, aren't you? The same fans she uh, had? Um, well, I, I'm going to I'm gonna do some helicopter action oh, with my Lord. hair. So, so you, you said helicopter action. You but said Diana lions. Ross, Diana Ross also left in a helicopter, yes. which was pretty mage. And you also said sharks. I did say sharks. And lions. And I, and I said a lion. Help me with it's this, It's going please. to be very wild out there. You're just going to have to tune in on Sunday. I'll, I'll be there. I, there's been actually a lot of uh, what we call sharkyography, which is uh, shark choreography. Okay. Yeah. Sharkyography. Okay. Twelve and a half minutes. We know that you love to change. You have fabulous wardrobes. Yeah. So you're always changing. How can you do that in twelve and a half minutes? How uh, many wardrobes we're, changes? Wearing a lot of layers. Okay. <laughs> wearing a lot of layers and a lot of tricks, a lot of magic tricks. Um, and, uh, you know, I'm not going to, I don't want to give away the number because there's like supposedly these polls going on in Vegas, which Six. I love. Well, that if that's your vote, then that's, that's your pretty, vote. That's pretty high. That's good. Uh, that would be very high, <laughs> uh, yes. I would say. Set the bar a little lower. Right? Yeah, but um, I, I think that it's going to be exciting to be able to go through all the looks. And I'm creating a lot of different worlds, actually, that evening. Uh, a few, maybe three or four different worlds. Um, so we'll see how many costumes get what to go in What will it. designate that it was a great performance? What needs to happen so that you feel good about it, that, man, I did it? I just want people to feel this incredible joy, the same incredible joy I think I will have on the field. Um, I said earlier today that if I can make over 100 million people smile at That's the good. same time all around the world, what incredible energy will be just going on? Then so. we know we know Lenny Kravitz will join you yes. out there, and there's been rumors and speculation about some other people. Can you give us any hints? Uh, well, never is anything confirmed until game day. Um, but all I can say is that I think it will be a, a very female strong uh, evening. And also, it's a great hint. I, I think also um, people are not going to expect this at all. Um, and I believe faces will melt when they hear the first uh, chord come out. The first chord rings and people are going to go, what? Are you playing any new songs? Um, I'm not playing any new songs, actually. Um, I'll be playing. Um, all the songs that have hit number one um, and cramming it as much as I can in there. Who do you think is going to win the game? Because you already said you have a, you well, know, not relationship, but you contact Russell they're Wilson. They're texting. Yeah, they're texting. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, I just think uh, I hope that the best team wins. No, um, you said the Seahawks earlier. Well, I'm, I'm voting for the Seahawks, but uh -huh. I love a good game. Mm -hmm. I love a, a, a good bit of healthy competition. Um, I hope that the Seahawks slay. Um, uh -oh. But, oh, there you go. <laughs> but if if the Patriots bring it, then they deserve the trophy. Let me ask you this. If you weren't performing at halftime, what would you be doing? Would you be with a group of friends? Would you be watching the game? Uh, I would be uh, probably in my hometown of Santa Barbara, uh, having a couple of margaritas at the bar and uh, watching some of the commercials, having a chuckle, and just being really honed in for the show, the halftime show. Right. Is this your actually second Super Bowl you attended? Because you said you came to the one at Madonna. Yes, actually, I, I got to see the Madonna show in, in person, and I was uh, part of the direct TV performance a few years ago. So I've had, I've had my, uh, I've wetted my whistle on the sports game here. But when you saw that, when you watched it, did you say? Because Madonna was a while ago. Did you say to yourself? That I'm, I'm going to do that one day. That's going to be me. No, I, I, I didn't know that my time was now. Uh, I feel like in some ways I about dropped my dream, and it's so exciting. And I feel like this is uh, God's way or the universe's way of offering me this opportunity to see if I can 
handle it. You know, it's like it's like the universe saying, we're going to take you to the next level. Are you worthy? There you go. So we'll see if I'm worthy. That's pretty good. Okay, so there have been, through the years, of course, a, a lot of talk about the halftime performances, and we've seen everything. Has yes. the NFL talked to you about keeping it clean? They've never had the actual conversation with me because I think there's a, a an understood trust when they picked me. Um, I'm very conscious, very aware, uh, very present in my life in general at all times, and I understand that the... Um, 12 and a half minutes that I've given comes with a certain uh, standard of responsibility. And for me, like, I can only control myself in my life at all times. I cannot control others, so I cannot speak for them. But for me, I will never self-sabotage that moment. And the next day's news, if there is any, or captions or what have you, I want it to be a about the music. Like, it would be so, uh, it would be so short-sighted of me to make it about anything mm -hmm. than the gift that I was given. I'm one of the 64 million followers, and, and I'd you like are. to thank, oh, yeah, I, I thank am, you. I, I am, am too. I am, thank and you. hearing your background and the roots with your parents and church and everything, I like you even more <laughs> than I've met you. Oh, and I'm, I'm proud of you. I thank really am you. proud of you. Thank you. I mean, I think that, like, you know, I, I was raised a, a different way, um, and it's not necessary, necessarily that I believe in the same things I grew up with. But I believe my parents really installed an incredible moral compass and character and integrity. And I like to do everything uh, that I do with an incredible amount of integrity. Between now and game time, yes. what does Katy Perry's schedule look like? Oh, um, it's just all about preparation. Uh, like I said, I've already kind of run the show about 30 to 35 times, so it's in my muscle memory. Mm -hmm. um, so it's just about staying healthy and focused and remembering the energy that I surround myself. and. You know, uh, it's so funny. I was, I was like, oh, maybe I'll go and see uh, my girl Riri at the Direct TV. And one of my managers was like, you can't be seen before the wedding. <laughs> I was like, okay. So no parties for you, no concerts. No, no, no. no. I, although after the game, um, I'm gonna have a party of my own, and I've ordered a hundred Papa John's pizzas. There you go. And I've actually ordered a hundred Girl Scout thin. Well, hold on. So we knew pick Dion out. and I knew I'm about this. Pick out because so you I pick haven't out. been able to for the past few months. We have a little I, I surprise need, for you we here. We got a surprise for you. Because we no. read about that you on got Twitter. Chocolate drop. That oh your dream gosh. after the game. We've got oh Terrell Davis, who is a two-time oh Super Bowl yes. champion over there. This is like the club. The sparkler. The club is in the house. Yep. There's the, the tweet right up there. You Your that dream out. after worked. the game. Oh, you are so Katie, cool. Yes. Katie, this is from the uh, this is from the local Arizona Girl Scouts group here. I can't here. believe they had a need left. I thought I bought them all. And this coming to you from a Super Bowl MVP here. That's what he does in his spare time. Get those out of here! I know. Get those out of here! Don't want you to eat all of them. Look at the Remy saying the they have to be chill. They have she to be chill. Fit. You can't just eat one of those. You can't just eat one of them. Let's see. It's his favorite, too. Right? Yes. This is like the right combination of sweet and salty, and they are not paying me to promote it. Get, get. <laughs> you want smell this? There you oh, go. Oh, well, some, some happy gonna fan that just got a thin mint. Somebody's going to eat that cookie, Becky. You know, that's it. I, thank you. I want to make it rain, Girl Scout Can, can you do one thing for me? Yes, sir. We're the not going to ask you to dance like we asked Beyonce. But oh, you I just, I just want to know. I love her. How are you going to end up, the last pose that you're going to end up, at the end of the show because it's in your muscle memory that you said so is it going to be a michael jackson or is it going to be just the last pose oh you want my last the pose? last That's pose the giveaway huh just the last pose i'll just be saying thank you Let's god there you go i will Very take that good. well done I will Katie take that. Perry. well done she, here Katie. go the boxes yeah. she's already go. ordered her these for me Ten these fans didn't camera. know how lucky they were going to be pounds. yeah these guys don't have a good time with those. pounds bigger. Everybody is going to scrutinize my weight. The blogs are mean. <laughs> there you go. But I'm just an all-American girl, and I like to eat food. One thing that we realized that Katy Perry is going to have fun no matter That's what. That's right. And Katie, if you're not having you. fun, Something's you wrong. don't have a soul. There you go. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us. We'll be watching on. We'll be watching Sunday afternoon. I'm so excited. I can't believe there's even a game going on. I thought it was just my performance. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is. Basically, it is.